It's the greatest Star Wars of the 2020. Oh, ah! Looks like I dropped a season there. Ugh. That was season seven. Well, we're not here to talk about season seven, season four, or season one, just like we did last time. Today is. Oh! 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 Uh, not this guy. This is old. Ooh, maybe I should get all the Star Wars movies. What do you think, guys? Will can we review every Star Wars movie? No. Okay. So with the Star Wars nonsense. Cause well it's once upon a time. I can hear Brayden. Okay, here's season two. We have just like season one, whatever season one is. Do you remember us reviewing season one? Look look at the characters. You have Snow White. Uh, Regina, Emma, Rumpel, and Charming. In season two, they added Hook. In season one, there is no Hook. Now, these two seasons don't have apples. Storybrooke and the Enchanted Forest. Storybrooke and the Enchanted Forest. Same with the characters. Uh, Enchanted Forest characters, Storybrooke characters. Get it? For season two, up here... There is no characters. They're still in their fairy tale forms. Their hook and uh, when you like wave it back and forth, like I said in season one, uh, you, uh, some of the objects that the characters are using, like this one, I guess they don't move. The characters are still the same. But when you continue lifting it up, you have the opposite of what season one did. In the front cover, you have the fairy tale world, and then under that, you have Storybrooke. For this one, it's the complete opposite. You're, you're, you see Storybrooke, you, the clock tower is over here. On this side, you kind of get like Rumpel Shop, and you have the curse with Emma and a sword standing in front of it. And then you have like the clouds. But then when you look at this one, both sides, it's the Enchant Forest, and then you have Storybrooke on this side, on both sides of the ship, you know. So you, you have. The Enchant Forest and then Storybook. So I, I always thought this was the Enchant Forest. So what I was going to say is that this... Uh, so instead of having the Enchant Forest on the outside, we have Storybook on the outside and the Enchant Forest on the inside. But then I realized it's both. You you have Storybook on both copies, but... And there, except it's smaller. And then you have the Enchant Forest. So it's kind of like Season 1 of the front. And then when you look at this, it's a new image of Season 2. And, well, just like season one, it says new episodes return this fall, but this was back before season three came on. It also says there's a more bonus, there's not as more bonus features as there was back in season one, but there are a lot of bonus features. Magic is here. When we did season one, we had Emma. Season seven was Regina again, and season four was Rumpel. But season two has Regina, so... The back is always the same. Um, on this back, it says on the top, A curse broken, a hero born, prepare to be spellbound. It also says, Oh wait, oh what a tangled web once weaves. This one's definitely from episode four. This one's from episode seven. How do I know? Because I know the flashbacks very well. This one's from either... This is like one of the first two or three episodes right here, so. And then you have Hook, Snow White, and Rumple. It's almost like the season seven returning characters, except you replace Snow White with Henry. When we looked on the back of season one, you had the castle, Snow White Castle, and Regina. That's pretty much it. On this one, you have just the trees. And there's not a lot of bonus features, so. If you want to read this really quick, you could read the description. Just um, pause the video really quick and read it. One bonus feature short, but you have you have Good Morning Storybrook. Wake up with Storybrook's favorite morning show. Bonus material. Swoo swoon over the da dashing Killian Jones, at, aka Captain Hook. 
So he's talking about Belle and yeah. They, this is when they decide to make her a main character after doing season one. And then you have the bloopers, the audio commentaries, and deleted scenes. This one has, I think, about the same amount of commentary as season one, but it's short by a bonus feature. So it's it's still very, very popular, but just a little bit under season one. So you can tell that the ratings are going down. So there's that if you want to relook at it. That's season two! But overall, yeah, this season's kind of a mess. This is the most messiest season. The second most messiest is season six, because it's like season two. But And then, well, season seven's not that messy. It does go a little too fast. I wish they spended another season on it. But that's season two for you. See you in the last video. Bye! Oh, and see you next week in Frandy Mac. Uh, the next video will also be about about Once Upon a Time, so we'll see you then. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Greatest actor of the 2020.